everybody, welcome back to my channel. My name's Allison, if you're new here, welcome to Wonderland. And today we are starting a nano vlog. Uh, I just wanted to give a quick intro for this vlog because the one I filmed originally got corrupted, so it's, uh, it's no more. But I hope you enjoy this vlog. It was super fun to film and I am currently on week three of nano because... Nano has been kicking my butt, but I hope you enjoyed this vlog. Let me know how you're doing on your Nano goal and what you're working on. I'd love to know, and let's just get into the vlog. Happy Nano. So it's day one of Camp NaNoWriMo, and I've written zero words. Uh, but that's okay, because I usually write my words later in the day. Anyways, it's just been kind of a crazy day with multiple things, I won't get into it, but I have my coffee. I actually just went and got food because I was starving and I wanted food. Uh, but I'm going to start writing. Uh, I think I mentioned this in my intro, but I'm currently trying desperately. It is my... Novellas have been so hard. I wanna make a whole video talking about novellas and like the difference between novellas and novels and all of that but yeah these have been more challenging than I expected but they're really important to the full story so I have to get them finished but I would like to finish the second one so I can go back and edit the first one and the second one at the same time and kind of because they kind of coincide together but yeah I'm going to write I'm going to eat I got a Costa Vida salad if you don't have a Costa Vida new year I'm sorry but perfection uh and i'm going to try not to get on twitter and look at all the beauty influencer drama that's going on i used to want to be a part of the beauty community and i still consider myself a part of it because i watch it but i don't want any part of that so yeah that's what's going on it is four o'clock right now so I will check in once I've hit um, like a good mark. I want to try to finish chapter 4 and 5 tonight. Um, I should also say my goal for this novella is 40,000 words. But I have written three of the chapters already. Uh, though they are a hot mess because I have to go back and fix them. Um, maybe I'll do that. I'll go back and fix them and then I'll start. Because that will just make my brain feel better. But yeah, I'm going to go do that. And we're off to the races of Camp NaNoWriMo, and I'm not okay. Since I updated you, it's actually 11:19 p.m. So, yeah, a while. I finished chapter four, which was like a huge deal because that chapter was really hard to write. Uh, there is an interaction between the two like main characters of this novella, uh, and I'm having a hard time with one of them. He's just like being stubborn, and I'm like someone that's like, I just want you to be happy, but. They're not happy right now, and there's a lot of tension. So yeah, that's that's what's happening. I also put up my audiobook audition on ACX, which is really exciting. Um, I'm noticing I'm getting really stressed out about it because I'm a perfectionist, and I've mentioned this before, how much of a perfectionist I am, but I don't think I realize it until moments like these where I sit here and freak out over an audiobook. Um, I don't know, I just, I don't want it to be not good, but I don't want it to be like too over the top. And I just, I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. So I 
am currently just waiting for more auditions that I have to right now and I've reached out to a couple other like audiobook read narrators they're narrators not readers um to see if they have any openings the one that I kind of liked a lot isn't doesn't have an opening until September and I don't want to wait that long so I'm not going to but yeah I just I guess I'm not picky with my audiobook so it's hard to get an opinion and like I don't know I just maybe I'll ask some of you guys to listen to some of the audiobook like auditions uh, to get some opinions because I have no idea what to do at this point but I am going to probably shower and then maybe write a little bit more I don't know but yeah it's gonna be a pretty chill night and I will update you either later after I've written or in the morning happy day two of camp nano I am out and about to do some errands I need to get some groceries at Target and I also treated myself to a half price diet cherry limeade from Sonic but I am going into Target to get some food this is my whole list I have a lot of things to get because I'm trying to be better and not eat junk because the past four months in quarantine um, or social distancing has just been me eating junk. So I'm gonna put on my mask now because people in Arizona don't know how to act right. You know, quarantine fashion. <laughs> chapter five today which is really good uh it this one is a longer chapter and also the last half of chapter five is only like a scene and I know what I want to happen but I want to watch some inspiration clips um specifically uh it the movie uh there's a scene I don't remember which kid it's with but um there's a scene where they're on the side of the house and it is like playing illusions for him and I want to watch those movies so I can get some inspiration so that's what I'm going to do tonight um specifically the first it uh, I just feel like this new movie is so it's so well done and the atmosphere that the directors did like the as atmospherical like creepiness that they did with the its illusions and like all of that it's just it's really good and I always am taking inspiration from stuff um that I want to like kind of get a vibe for so that's what I want to do I want to watch it and get like an inspo vibe uh because it will get me like in the headspace tomorrow for that scene and then I want to finish chapter six and maybe seven um we're getting into some really fun scenes that are happening there's like a party there's some moments between the main character and the love interest and i'm just like really excited for those moments um so i feel like after i finish this scene that i'm finishing out chapter five with it's gonna get really exciting and really fun and it's gonna be a really fun nano um, I will tell you what my word count is. So my official nano word count is 6,907 words. Now to preface that, I did write some more words before nano so that those aren't like all the words I've written in two days. Don't like, don't get me, <laughs> like don't think I'm some crazy writer that can write that much. I mean some people can but like I cannot do that. Um, I just want to track it so I'm tracking like the word count in this novel as well as my progress that I'm getting through this novel because all I want to do is get through this novella 
and then I can start editing next month. All right, well, I'm gonna go and watch my movies and shower because that's, that's what normal people do. I forgot to update y'all about uh, today. Uh, so it is July 6th. Well, technically it's July 7th, but shh. Uh, and I did a live sprint, as you saw earlier, with author Angela Ann, which was really fun. I love doing live sprints. And then I went over to my best friend's house and watched Hamilton. I cried. I cried so hard and... I love that show so much, but I had a lot of fun. I wrote all the way to chapter 7, which is really good, and that means I only have, like, a couple more chapters till I'm halfway through this novella, and I'm, like, so excited, which because that means I'm ahead of schedule for NaNo. And, yeah, uh, I will probably do one more day in this vlog. Uh, that way I can upload it on time but uh it's been a really fun first week of nano um i might participate in some more writing sprints but yeah i am going to probably watch hamilton again or turn it on in the background while i do other things because i'm obsessed i'm back in 2016 when i was obsessed before so i don't know i just i love love that show a lot but yeah it is late so i'm going to go do that so I never ended up uh, updating you guys on the next day because I forgot, but I am doing pretty well on my nano goal. I am almost finished with the novella. I have about five chapters left, which is super exciting because that means editing is just around the corner and I'm so excited for that. Um, it has been challenging, I'm not gonna lie. Being in quarantine, especially during nano season, uh, or not being able to go places and write has been very challenging because I am someone who likes to go to coffee shops and write, and I think the chaos of coffee shops makes me more inspired or helps me focus more. I don't know, being at home has been a distraction in its of itself because one second I sit down to write, I'm ready to write, and someone needs me. My mom needs me to go do something, the dog is scratching at my door, my dad's on a phone call, you know, the whole shebang. So I have been very distracted, I'm not gonna lie, but I'm proud of myself that I have gotten to a point in my writing of Camp Nano that I have been able to almost finish this novella. I really love both Aspen and Claire's story. If you don't know, novella number one is Aspen's story. Novella number two is Claire Holloway's story. And I really, really love Claire's story. That's the one I'm writing right now. But yeah, uh, I'm also working on a secret project during Nano as well, which I'll be announcing soon. So stay tuned for that. Um, it's coming and it has to do with one of my other best friends. I hope you enjoyed this writing vlog. Let me know down below just some of your goals for the rest of Nano or, you know, what has been frustrating for you with Nano. Just vent in my comments. I'm all ears. Also, I love how I'm wearing a long sleeve black sweater in the middle of July when it's like 114 out. Can you tell I want it to be fall weather again because I thrive in fall clothes. But I will see you in my next video. Bye loves.